this is a walkthrough of the Catro platform. If you have never heard anything about us, you're at the right place. This will tell you everything you need to know. So Catro is an online placement cell for tech jobs. People come to our website, take our hiring test and get interview calls based on the performance. Some key features to note here is that this is totally free for developers. It's mentioned here. We are funded by companies who trust us to find the best talent for them. Your success is our mission. Even after you get a job from us, you don't owe us anything. You don't pay us anything. Another thing to note here is the test is fair to all. What does that mean? We test for your skills irrespective of your background. It's not like you need to have a B.Tech CSE degree to get a job in tech. You can come from any background. You can uh, have a gap year. You can be working in a non-tech domain or you might be uh, you want to switch. You're already working in tech. People from all sorts of backgrounds come to us. They prove their skills and then they get opportunities. So it's fair to everyone. And on the left side, you will see a bunch of upcoming tests. Um, if you notice the dates, July 27, August 3, August 10, you'll see that we run these hiring tests very frequently. So we'll have something or the other running every Sunday and we give you unlimited retries. We don't limit your chances. Even if you don't get selected in a particular test, there's no need to worry. You can attempt it again next time. In fact, we encourage it. Applying multiple times does not count against you. What are the benefits of this? You can see on the right hand side, there are a bunch of job openings. Uh, this is like a sneak preview and there are hundreds of such openings that we have from our hiring partners. So based on your performance, we pitch you to these companies. We give you the interview and then you sort of uh, move ahead um, with the process. And another side effect or another meta benefit of appearing for a test is it gives you a real world calibration of where you stand because we don't test for puzzles. We test for what will you do on a day to day basis on that job. So completing them within a time frame is a very good calibration for yourself. So yeah, um, you can see a bunch of uh, uh, companies that we work with. Some FAQs is Catro really free. That is true. Even after you get a job from us, you don't pay or you don't owe anything to us. We are funded by companies to find the best talent in India. What kind of a test is it? It includes practical coding challenges. Um, we don't test for puzzles like we mentioned. I I'll talk more about this in a few minutes. Uh, if you're not ready, you can just register for the next test. How many attempts do I get? You get unlimited attempts. Okay, this is a good point. What languages are, can I use? We are tech agnostic. What that means is, let's say if it's front end, you can use React or Vue or Angular, we don't care. For mobile, you could be building in Android or iOS, anything. For back end, you could uh, uh, be working in, uh, let's say Java, PHP, Python, Golang, anything works. We test for fundamentals. We can use any language or framework or tool in our tests. Um, if you're in college, this is not for you. This is only for people who can join a full-time job immediately. So yeah, um, you can apply after college ends. What happens after the test? Based on your performance, we pitch your profile to companies. Uh, this is something about me. Hi, my name is Swapnil. I have worked as a backend developer at Amazon in my corporate career. And I was also a product manager at Misho. And for the last five years, I've been running Catro. And the mission that I am on is to impact 30,000 careers by 2030. So yeah, that is about it. Let me show you how, how to register for it. You can uh, click on the upcoming tests. You will see um, the list of tests and the time. Let's say you click on the July 27 test. You will see the test page. Uh, you'll be given a small project to build the test your skills. You'll see uh, what to expect in a hiring test. I'm just clicking opening in the next tab. And um, um, during the timings mentioned here, you'll see the questions here itself. 
So you can just refresh this page on this time and you'll get the question here. All right, so what to expect in our hiring tests? For backend, we test for database design, API creation, integration, and performance optimization. For frontend, we test for state management and building layouts and interactions. For full stack, it's basically a combination of both backend and frontend. For mobile dev, it's similar to frontend, but on mobile uh, layouts. So components, navigation, state management. For DevOps, we test cloud infrastructure, which is like your CI, CD pipelines, containerization, automation, etc. So we give you a small project and you need to build it in that particular time frame. The best part is that you can later enhance it into a portfolio project as well. Uh, cool. So that is pretty much about uh, about the test. Let me just uh, open and let me just see uh, if I want to share a couple more things. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll, I'll talk about this. And uh, yeah, okay, I'll, I'll talk about this as well. Uh, earlier, we, we used we were used to call uh, rocket careers. So you can see this, uh, uh, this post we started, like, in back in 2020, we started as a job challenge, then we renamed ourselves to elevate labs, then we became rocket careers. Now finally, we are Cactro because Cactro uh, is is derived from like cactus plus hero. And uh, just like cactus thrives in harsh conditions, we believe that resilient individuals can thrive in tech with the right opportunities. And that is the kind of uh, demographics that we want to represent. So cactus ka kya hota hai na ki matlab uh, usko utna pani chahiye nahi like even if you just give it a small amount of water it will bloom so that is that is what uh, uh, we have now finally settled down into um, so meaning i already talked about cactus is the ultimate symbol of resilience and here are some of our tenet, tenets which basically guide everything we do we are impact driven we prioritize skills over pedigree. We are very closely integrated with the market dynamics because that is what um, tells us what market is looking for. And based on that, we sort of design our tests and uh, uh, careers are 30 years long. So we don't stop at your first job. There are alums which have gotten their second, third job with us. So yeah, even if you have any any experience you have two years experience five years experience ten years experience you can come to us and get your next job so we are here for every milestone and uh, yeah uh, I, I think this is this is a good summary of like whether we are for you or we are not for you if you come from a top 50 college in india you don't need us we open doors for folks jinka resume hi reject ho, ho jata hai screening stage pe. So that is, uh, that is our uh, ideal target audience. So we take bets on the underdog, on the underdogs. We pitch for you, we fight for you. We help you negotiate salary as well. Like we have seen, ki bhai, um, it's it's very hard for people to talk numbers, talk money. So uh, we help you do that as well. And uh, yeah, we are building a world where resilience meets opportunity. We are in this for the long term. We are Cactro. Okay, let me quickly talk about uh, the benefits of uh, giving the tests, even if you're not looking for a job. We have seen an interesting pattern unfold. Um, when candidates take one of our real world assignments, let's say uh, in backend making an API or uh, solving something, uh, when the problem is very concrete, either something clicks or something gets stuck. When something gets stuck, that is where the magic begins because you cannot unsee the gap. <laughs> so it's, it's like there's a very unique psychology behind behind it. Once you get stuck, uh, it could be due to a missing concept, a misunderstood tool design flow. But once you are stuck, there's a discomfort that comes uh, into you. Uh, unlike MCQs or superficial puzzles, 
Catrose tests expose the real bottlenecks holding you back. Like there was a bug which you couldn't uh, fix, the API you couldn't write, or the database schema you did you were not sure how to model that. When you um, when you get stuck here, they are initially demoralizing, but after that they motivate you to fix that gap. It's not a test; it's it's a mirror. Um, this <laughs> this is something that we hear from uh, from candidates a lot. They thought they were good at SQL. Turns out they never worked with data sets, large data sets before. Um, built APIs, but not sh not sure how it works under performance. Uh, how their performance works under heavy load. Um, so that is that is what we reveal about you. It's a very fast feedback flywheel. You attempt, you get stuck, then you reflect, then you fix, and then you reattempt. So this loop is very powerful and uh, it it's built for growth so it's it's not like we are grading you it's it's just that you will yourself see that hey this is a bottom like that i need to fix and uh, you can take them to assess your interview readiness or find interview gaps or simply to rekindle your builder's mindset if it's if there's been some time since you built anything you can just uh, sign up for the challenge and start building some side project for your resume and uh, whatever the reason one thing is you will learn something new while attempting the test and that is what uh, our aim is that that's the real win for us here are some of the uh, testimonials from people who have attempted the test uh, they really liked the problem uh, it was challenging which made me hooked to the process of developing the app made it fun like just think about this right a hiring test which was fun it's like so unheard of uh, i like these tests i'm learning a lot from these tests so basically you know there are people who attempt multiple times um, this test helped me understand the skills i want to improve and get the hand of it so yeah uh, that is pretty much about it so for signing up you can um, go to this page and just look around uh, and uh, yeah <laughs> like like it says here if you think you're good at coding and uh, you're looking for opportunities and you want someone to fight for you this is your opportunity to prove yourself let your skills speak for you and let the best at this help you so yeah that pretty much some setup so yeah uh, let me know in the comments if, if you have any more doubts. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.